A federal judge issued a nationwide preliminary injunction halting the Biden administration's ban on the oil lease sales on public lands. This is a major win for workers in oil and industry and consumers who have felt pain at the pump. Joining us to discuss is Louisiana Attorney General Jeff Landry. AJ, good to see you. Thanks so much for coming on. Kind of explain this to us if you can. What does this preliminary injunction do, specifically in your state of Louisiana? So basically what happened was that uh, the president at the very early stages of the administration issued basically a constructive moratorium, we call it, basically blocking all federal, all new leases on federal lands for oil and gas activity. We went into court and said that he was stepping outside of his authority. We got a federal judge here in Louisiana to agree and thereby basically ordering the administration to go back through the process and begin leasing federal lands again uh, to oil and gas companies, in, 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 in essence, starting the process uh, over again. What he was, what the president and were trying to do was basically put a pause on it, a permanent pause that would disrupt the industry such that it would, it would basically take years uh, for the industry to catch up to where it was before. How long will this last, do you think? Will there be pushback on this? Well, I'm sure there'll be some pushback. What's disappointing is that this administration is crushing the poor and the middle class in their pocketbooks uh, in high energy prices. We have seen the price of gas uh, rise uh, since the, the, the president got sworn in and basically hurting those people at the pump. It's costing American families money in their budgets. Again, again at a time when we're finally getting back to vacation, it's driving season again and we're feeling that pain at the pump. 